Hello ABAP Academy community. Recently, I've received one question from uh, people in our audience. And this question is uh, about getting this runtime error. Uh, and uh, so, so I've received a project uh, or source code. And here is also the problem that is uh, going on. So what happens is, uh, or here is the name of runtime error, get WA not assigned. What is that? Okay, uh, so let me just quickly run this program in a separate window so that we don't lose this uh, source code. So this is the, the program. When I press F8, I need to choose one CSV file, for example, this one. And then when I press F8, uh, I need to allow it to go uh, with this file. And this is the runtime error, get WA. Uh, not assigned, all right? So when you, when when I scroll down and take a look at all, no, where is the problem? Um, here we here we uh, see what is the problem. So basically, um, insert into E tab. When I double, when I click on uh, the source code, I get to the source code. But what I can do, what is uh, what I what I really want to do, is to go to debug mode and check it out. Okay, so some uh, value is not assigned. We will find out if you explore further that GT data, uh, GT data, this field symbol is not assigned. Okay, um, and this is a problem. That person is trying to pass inside to the subroutine field symbol which is not assigned all right so so anytime uh, you are working with field symbols and you want to pass them or you want to use them somehow in your source code you need to make sure you firstly assign this field symbol so let me go to the source code and show you how you can solve this problem so let me just close this window uh, because we don't need this anymore. And when I go to edit mode and I scroll down um, and see where is the problem. So basically this is a, a, a subroutine called create internal table. When I double click on that and I go inside, I see that um, right here inside of the subroutine, that person wants to create um, field symbol uh, of an internal table. Um, of specific uh, type, okay, which is not possible because we cannot do it this way. Uh, so what we can do, we need to, or what we, what we have to do, we need to create the whole internal table in the main program. So let me just copy this part of the code with create data, uh, reference data, type standard table of specific structure and we need to assign this reference created right here in this in this line to the field symbol okay so let me go back to the main program and i will um, comment out this part of the code and let me just end uh, paste uh, the part of the code which is creating this uh, field symbol uh, right here so so what i need to do what i need to have is to, is to have um, uh, reference data, um, data uh, table structure, and uh, assign it to the GT data. Okay, so Control C, Control V, uh, and, and we, ju we just need to quickly uh, somehow arrange uh, this creation of in of an internal table. So. When I press Ctrl F2 or syntax checker, I see that LRF data is not created, so it is still in the in in the uh, subroutine. Uh, so let me just go quickly to the subroutines, and I want to go to create internal table. And I'll, just to quickly show you, I will just copy and paste everything um, to the main program uh, so that I can uh, see what is in there. All right, so LV table structure. Let me just go back. LV table structure, how is that used? Okay, so GV table name. All right, so, so, so we just need this LRF data. We will just start it with G because it's going to be created in the main program. So not only in uh, the subroutine. And I just control X uh, this part and go to the dec declaration part and just paste it there all right um okay so we just need gref data gref data 
into LV table structure. And right now we need to table name. Okay, so table name is here, GV table name, and this should work. So control F2 uh, for syntax checker, control F3 for activating the source code. And uh, let's create a uh, breakpoint right here and let's press F8. So I will again choose the specific CSV file. And right here, when we have this internal table already created, we can, we should be able to, um, to, to go inside of this subroutine because right here, this subroutine, um, um, when I'm going to call this subroutine, all of the variables and field symbols are, are already created. In this, in this case, this field symbol is not only created or declared in a main program, but also assigned. I can see that this GT data is already visible and I can double click on uh, this field symbol in the uh, debug mode so that this way, when I go inside of the subroutine, I can pass this field symbol and I don't get the problem uh, in in the in the runtime error that the person um, let us know about this. So this is the way on how you can solve this. And anytime you get such kind of runtime error, you just need to make sure that this or so that so that the field symbol is assigned and uh, or or anything that you are working with is is, is assigned, and then you will be able to to move forward with that. All right, so that's all from my side for now. Take care and see you soon. Bye.